Okay, well, let's uh, continue uh, talking about uh, our first lab. This is task eight from chapter one, and we're going to talk about the right hand side of the start menu. Let's go ahead and just do the task and then we'll elaborate on it. So it says drag the top and right edge of your start menu so that it is as wide as possible. Create a group on upper right entitled My Accessories and place any six Windows accessories in it, you know, like WordPad, Paint, stuff like that. You will find these accessories in the Windows Accessories folder off of the start menu. To a print screen of the open start menu showing your new group and call this print screen task eight start menu right side. Okay, so let's just do it one step at a time. Start menu. So well, let's go ahead and um, drag the right edge start menu so it's as wide as possible. Okay, then it says um, place any six Windows accessories, you know, create a group on the upper right hand side called my um, thingy. So let's just see where, where the, uh, my accessories are. My accessories, the Windows accessories. <laughs> Believe it or not, we still got Windows Explorer in there. So if I get Notepad and drop it over here, that gives me, you know, a, uh, you know, a, another area here. Then I can go ahead and get another one, paint, and drop that there, okay? So how do I name the group? I can just go ahead and click above it. And what am I supposed to call it? My accessories. Probably could have named the group first, but I just did that afterwards, sorry. Um, so I gotta, I gotta do six of these. And it really doesn't matter which one. This is, oh, what is that? That's that new Paint 3D. Uh, what about the snipping tool? The steps recorder? That was in a different group. <laughs> and what else? Uh, WordPad. Any six, right? So those are, those are my six on there. And it's in a, they're all in this little uh, group on here. Okay. You can edit it by clicking in that area. Okay, so let's just do a print screen. I'll come back and over elaborate, um, you know, on this. So um, do a print screen. So I'm gonna do a print screen. Go to paint. And then do a control V, popped right in there. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and save it. And I'm gonna go ahead and call it task eight start menu dash right side. So we talked about the left side, the middle, and then now the right side. PNG is fine, JPEG's a little smaller. All right. So now for the elaboration. So this tile world over here, this was um, inherited from the days of Windows 8. And if you right mouse click on any one of these tiles, you can have a menu that lets you do all kinds of stuff, such as uninstall. We can also unpin it from the start menu. We can resize it. We can make it small, medium, more. We can pin it to the taskbar like if you really want it. To, well, you you may want it on the taskbar, you know. Um, so um, that's the right mouse. Right mouse clicking we're going to be using a lot of guys. So you can write. When, I usually tell my students when in doubt, right mouse click. You right mouse click if you want to do something to that. Notice how you can't uninstall on the snipping tool, you know. But paint, can I uninstall that? Yeah, I could, uh, uh, I would have, uh, it, uh, yeah, it, it lets me to uninstall it, you know. So you can change, the, you can resize these. Uh, for a while there, I was resizing news and, and stuff like that, you know, but, you know, I, I um, stopped using this a whole lot. So basically, my elaboration on this, if you don't like this stuff, 
you can just right mouse click on here and unpin. I wonder, uh, you think that they would let you do, no, you can't uh, uh, do them all. Apparently you gotta do one at a time. What a drag, right? So if you continue to unpin, you end up getting rid of all of this stuff. You can always add it later. And if you get rid of all of it, then you can go ahead and just close this area here and then now your start menu is a little cleaner. You know, so you, you may or may not want to do that. If you ever want it back, you can just come back over here and then you got to navigate to where those, those apps are. You know, like the, um, the weather app, where, where was that? Uh, you know, here's weather. I can get that and just drop it in there. And there's my weather app. And then I just go through the same old stuff of creating a group. And, you know, giving it a name if I want. You can even even create folders. I mean, there's a, probably a little bit too much to do uh, with this. I'll, I, I For a while there, I was, you know, doing this large, uh, the weather and the news and stuff like that. I kind of like that, but um, I'm just not doing that you know anymore okay so i'm gonna go ahead and unpin it and there's just really so many other ways of customizing this start menu but for right now hey it's a start right so uh first a bit of this over and out